Letting Go, How to Stop Being a Digital Pack Rat. If you're like most internet marketers, you have a dozen irons in the fire at any given moment. Maybe it's the low threshold for starting a new website or maybe it's the way that people hop from business idea to business idea, but it seems like internet marketing breeds digital pack rats. If you have more than 50 domains registered and are only using two of them, then you've become a digital pack rat. Marketers hold on to ideas and projects until they are no longer useful, trying to juggle so many. Balls in the air can be really damaging to your business. If you have your energy spread in dozens of different directions, you'll have no time to devote to the projects that really matter. It's time to clear out your digital closet and get organized. Point one of the biggest ways that people become pack rats is with their ideas. They hold on to niche ideas, side ideas, or product ideas, and tell themselves that someday they will make them happen. Not only are you crowding your online files with lists of ideas that will never happen, you're preventing yourself from truly growing. You may come across a great new idea, but drag your feet on it because you promised yourself that you'd complete these five other projects first. What ends up happening is that you never complete those five other projects and your new idea never sees the light of day. Take an honest look at your list of project ideas. If there are ideas that have been on there for more than two months, take them off of your list. The fact that you haven't been able to put them into action within the last eight weeks means that you aren't very passionate about the idea and it's time to make way for new ideas. If you think it's hard to let go of ideas, it's even harder to let go of projects that are already running. Most marketers develop several affiliate sites, AdSense sites, or product sites in order to have multiple streams of income. Although this concept works in theory, most often marketers end up with a variety of sites that aren't doing anything. They hold on to these sites and dump more money and time into them in order to try to get them profitable. If you're guilty of trying to keep your sites on life support too long, it's time to focus your attention on what is really making you money. If you don't have anything yet that is making you money, focus on the niche that has the most potential and pour all of your energy into that. Get it profitable and then plan your next move. Stop spending time and energy on a dozen different sites. Your efforts with them aren't wasted. Every site is a learning experience even if it doesn't make you a ton of money. The bottom line is that you only have so much time in the day and so much energy to put towards your marketing business. If you are spreading yourself thin in a dozen directions, you're not going to get anywhere. Don't drag yourself down with a bunch of digital junk, clean out your virtual closet and focus on what really matters.